Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Dylan and welcome back to another episode of my Halo 5 Guardians walkthrough on my Road to Halo Infinite series. Today we will be playing through the mission known as Unconfirmed. If you guys are new here, please be sure to subscribe to my channel for more weekly game walkthroughs. Without further ado, let's just jump back right into this. Alright, looks like we're picking up right where we left off from the last episode. We're, we're getting dropped off by the loading so station Pelican Inns to the mine area. My team's there to keep an eye on things Hopefully well track right. down the Master Chief and Blue Team. Alright, where the fuck am I supposed to go right now? Find our target to be out Guess I'll follow the these Marines. Prometheans! Oh! Contact! Have to. Right, let's clear out this area. So we can move on. I've like got some more enemies coming in. You kill me right now, man. I wish the fucking and soldiers weren't such bullet sponges. Especially like in, when you're playing like Warzone Firefly and multiplayer, they're like such bullet sponges. Like, like not as much bullet sponges as the knights, but still, I think it takes a little bit too much to kill the knights. I mean, the soldiers. I feel like they should just. Just take a few more and less bullets to kill all of them and like And like the best way to kill them is just to fucking assassinate them. And even then you gotta watch out for their fucking and better for melee attack. Otherwise they'll really fucking take you out. Well I'm like going for the soldiers in the middle because they can fucking and hit you and fucking pick you up before you can blink. Sometimes, if you're not careful, I'm mostly referring to them when you're like in melee combat with them. Because I've been taken out by these fools multiple times in the past in melee combat because I'm not being careful. See, I just fucking got my fucking shield blasted. Fucking stay down, you bitch. Alright, I saw a scatter shot back there. I'll pick up in a second. I'm gonna take this fool down. Alright. Weird. Alright, sorry about that guys. I don't know what the fuck just happened, but my controller fucking turned off for some reason. I don't know why. It's on half um fucking battery. I feel like it's the fucking rechargeable battery pack that I've been using for years now is starting to fucking die on me, so I it might have to start switching back to regular batteries from the store again, which I really don't want to do, so I might order new battery packs for my fucking Xbox One controller. Because these ones are currently gonna fucking die on me. Like a I don't know what Lane it is. Pays a generations of it's been a fucking pattern recently. Well, it's like while oh, I fucking it. lost the fucking connection to my controller. Fucking and Fireteam Osiris just cleared out the rest of the enemies for me. Alright, looks like I got some more ammunition over here. Press a Hydra. Help me out greatly. With these fucking knights down there. Well, stay the fuck down, you fucking bitch. There we go. Hopefully my controller doesn't fucking turn off again. Otherwise, I'm gonna be very upset. 
to that, or I mean, I'll have to go, go get onto my local DIY center or something to go get some batteries. Well, I think I will like go on Amazon or something sometime later today and get replacement or charge the battery pack. I don't know why I just turned them off. Fun, I really don't. But it is where it is. Can't wait to change the fact that they're gonna fucking die on me. All batteries die at some point in the day around. Right, I need to eat another weapon like right now. It's like we've got tons of scatter shot ammunition on the floor, so I'll just grab the fucking scatter shot to use, I guess. Clear. Team just left their prowler Is there the anything up here everything? I can use? Must have landed here for a reason. Kind of like SMG. Might tell us something. Let's run a scare. Oh. Looks like I've got a shotgun over here as well. I'll take the shotgun over the fucking SMG an any day. Alright, the ship lods. Look at this. There is Linda's signature or sniper rifle right there, but I'm not really good with a sniper rifle, so I'm not gonna bother picking it up. I am not good at sniping in fucking and sparring in sparring multiplayer. For to the mine and I'm definitely not position. gonna be e fucking good enough to fucking snipe fucking in uh, NPCs. I'm, asking I'm just a terrible I'm shot when it comes to sniping. I prefer close quarters weapons, such as the two shotguns I currently have in my inventory. All right, where the fuck are we supposed to go now? Where are we supposed to go, man? I'm guessing we're supposed to go down to a mine or something. Took location. All right, we're supposed to go to over here. Down to the mine, I'm guessing. Stand back, snipers, perched ahead. I'll clear the way out, out fucking in marine. Don't worry, I'll just fucking spar and charge right through that fucking crate. Oh, we got more enemies incoming. Oh, the only fucking soldiers that actually go down in one hit are the fucking sniper versions, actually. The others are a fucking pain in the ass to kill. Hopefully these fucking soldiers go down with ease now that I have fucking shotguns in my fucking inventory. Alright. So far so good. Got a few more enemies to deal with. Or a grenade up there. What are you doing hiding up here, you stupid soldier? You can't escape us. This area is secured. Don't you know that it's fucking a door in strategy to fucking location. move around after you try to Open fucking snipe now, someone? Man. It's like sniper or skill combat. number one. Think they found another entrance? My money's on the Prometheans never engaging them. Well, that doesn't make any sense. <laughs> Oh shit, got this guy. What the? What the fuck? That should have been a fucking assassination right there, man. That was just fucking bullshit. Alright, I'm gonna fucking turn on these turrets, man. That was just fucking bullshit right there, man. That should have been a fucking assassination right there. Thankfully, I still got the assassination after my second attempt to move in the back. But that should have fucking activated on the first fucking melee. 
Alright, I'm gonna fucking mow these bastards down, man. Want some of this, bro? You too, huh? Want some? Alright, where are these fucking enemies coming from? I think we're supposed to go down here. Spawn gate! Bringing more Prometheus! Alright, come on. Um, them spawning in like this actually kind of reminds me of how the fucking enemies spawn in at Marvel's Avengers. They just like fucking teleport in right in front of you sometimes. Like, seeing similarities between this game and Marvel's Avengers and the fucking spawn system. Oh. I just fucking killed myself apparently. Alright, let me throw a few frags down there and I'll take care of those fucking Prometheans. I think I might need a better weapon in soon. Let me grab this suppressor. Thank god the fucking and suppressor in this game has lock on the cannon. Otherwise, I think it would just be just a slightly better version than the one in here before. The one in here before is, is just complete crap, really. Not really a big fan of Prometheus weapons in general in Halo 4 and Halo 5. I think they're just generic versions of the human weapons. I think ever since um, fucking Halo 3 took over and they were making Halo 4 and Halo 5, they were just trying to fucking make Covenant in weapons and the Promethean weapons like too similar to human weapons. Like the stone rifle just looks like an alien version of the human assault rifle. The Scattershot was basically no the foreigner's version Marine. of the human shotgun. You know, we've seen Promethean attacks Other than since that, Requiem. I don't really no know of any Something them what up, that's for sure. the fuck. Oh, and then they had to change the, the fucking design of the fucking and Scorpion tank in Halo 5. Which I did not like. They changed a lot of stuff. Halo 4 and Halo 5, which did not need to be changed. Area's clear. Move into the structure. Thank God they're going back to a more classic art style in Halo Infinite. What I do it would give them props for in Halo Infinite is that they're they're combining elements of both classic and the Reclaimer Earth Saga art style. Which I I don't really uh, have a big like problem with I just think a classic art style is better overall but uh, Chief's armor it looks like it's taking heavy inspiration from the armor from Halo Legend from the package episode something here which Similar I think that armor is monitor. one of the best Chief's armor that ever um, was created Move forward, but keep an eye on them. look at all of this Record everything. We can get a good look at it later. Alright, looks like there's gonna be a cutscene in a second actually. Spartans, I'm losing your Governor? Privacy at last. <laughs> Privacy at last. I don't think Buck Light I the governor. <laughs> I don't think uh, Buck Light's governor is slown that Knocker. much. I just realized. Buck was saying blue team didn't fight Prometheans. Well, they didn't have to sweet-talk Sloan, either. You think Sloan let them down here? Reckon it's a possibility. A possibility, but not a certainty. If Sloan's hiding something... Right, I hope I find another weapon after, after this cutscene, because... I am really out of ammunition in my shotgun right now.
To serve her. What was that? Well, let's go find out. We're sitting ducks here. Agreed. Move! Your presence in the Guardian's shelter is undesirable. Are you the guardian? I am a warden of eternal. I stand in service to Cortana. Cortana? The other humans are approved for passage. Regretfully, you are not. That sounds like a threat. Vacate his shelter now. That was a threat, all right. Oh dear, here we go. Kind of fucking fight Where'd this come fucker. From? Like, Something new. I think you've like fight this fucker like maybe like eight or, or nine times in this fucking campaign. It's fucking ridiculous how many times I fucking recycle this bastard in this fucking campaign. Yeah, it's like after you fucking. Fight this guy like the fucking ninth time in this fucking campaign's like Is it done? And then you fight it one more time. Okay, and then they have to fucking add him as a fucking mythic and legendary boss and really entire fight. Not cool man. How are you not the fuck dead man? Stay the fuck down, you fucking bastard. I'm gonna keep on fucking stabbing you in your fucking core if you don't fucking stay the hell down. Or I'm gonna grab this weapon. The Warden Eternal. He said he served Cortana. Alright, is there another weapon I can grab before moving on to the next area? Another quake. Bad news. Should get moving. The warden was protecting whatever lies below. Don't think so, actually. Wait. He called it the Guardian. Cortana is connected. I think there's a weapon up here. And that makes it the Master Chief's most likely. Alright, here we go. We find it. We find him. Let's go. Alright, I think I was supposed to go up that way, actually. Oh, never mind. The door opened over here. The warden said Cortana was calling them to her. She's not here. Oh, well, they built him big, didn't they? Figure that's the Guardian? Can't get much by a buck. Up here! Stay where you are. One one seven, stand down. Sir, you are absent without leave. This is your one chance to come home peacefully. Blue team, stand down. I have a job to do. Cortana's our concern now, sir. Like hell she is.
Damn it. Well, guys, that is going to be the end of this episode. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. When we come back next time, we'll be playing through Mission 6, Evacuation. Hope you guys have a great rest of your day, and I will see you guys in my next video. Have a good one, guys.